The UCL Lancet Commission uh, from 2018 calls migration the defining issue of our times. Of the one million immigrants that come to the United States annually, 25% of them come through New York City. Recent estimates have put the number of undocumented immigrants in New York City alone at about half a million. And uh, at least half of those are without health insurance. We're looking for students who want to be challenged, who want to really understand how global health impacts the world and how every problem is not only a problem for one community or one nation, but for the world. So what we see is despite the positive impacts of migration globally, and we see that migrants and migration often faces challenges. And these challenges really threaten basic human rights, including the right to health. And despite global commitments, we see that migrants are often left behind. The new master's program in global and migrant health policy is unique. It's unique because it helps students understand the complexity of global health policies and then connect them to migrant health. Health is affected at many levels, from local to global. Uh, certainly it's at the global level where policy and solidarity comes to play, and it's at the local level where ultimately action takes place. So it bridging global solidarity, global policy, with public health action within specific communities and parts of specific communities is the opportunity that we're trying to highlight in this MS. The new MS program in global and migrant health is 33 credits. It's completely online, so students can complete the program wherever they are in the world. And I think one of the real advantages of the program is that students can take advantage of all the resources of the CUNY Graduate School of Public Health and Health Policy, but at the same time, focus on required courses and concentration courses that give them that extra confidence and confidence and skills around migrant health. I think one of the strengths of this program is its online format. I've been able to collaborate um, with the professors and with the students for the last year. But I think this program has been set up really well to establish those relationships. We have recruited top-notch students as well as very high quality faculty with experiences, uh, both in practice and in academe with a strong research portfolio. I think one of the great strengths of the CUNY School of Public Health is the diversity of our faculty. We bring together a really wide range of expertise, both in content areas and in methods. Building an effective health system takes the work of practitioners and policymakers at the federal, state, and municipal levels. Students in and graduates of the Masters of Science in Global and Migrant Health Policy would be well prepared for positions in local public health practice and in local government uh, because of the skills that they would develop in the program. And those include uh, basic epidemiological analysis uh, and understanding demographic uh, characteristics and trends among immigrant populations. Uh, policy analysis skills as it relates to healthcare system policies, um, as well as skills related to working with and the importance of working with community-based organizations. We've been involved in a wide range of projects that have focused on the health of immigrant and refugee populations. One such project is a pilot study on the reproductive health access of immigrant and refugees in Western New York State, with a particular focus on medication abortion. This is an example of the kinds of projects that we do that provide opportunities for our graduate students to partner with us as research assistants. My experience working with Dr. Romero as her research assistant was one of the most important pieces of my time at CUNY SPH. I learned here how to write policy briefs. I learned how to engage with partners all over the world. These are things that I'm now using every single day in my workplace and I got them here. Our hope, and need I say our ambition, is to create a new cohort of specialists in public health who have the deep understanding of that intersection between the migrant experience and the global experience. This cohort of graduates will be leaders 
uh, in the public health world in the future.